Hello everybody, this is Speaking Dragon here, talking about this book called War is Boring. It about, the graphic note is talking about this man named David Axe. He is a war correspondent that has been doing that for ever since the Syrian crisis. In that time, he had met a lot of people during his trip into different countries where there had been war and war on terror, civil war, and just unrest at, in general. And we seen David uh, talking to the man who he is traveling with at chat. So this story is a prelude to everything that been going on during his whole experience before he went to chat. And in this time, we see his character, his interaction with other people, other journalists, his bosses and editors, his people that he knows as cartoonists, the people who sell weapons, and how he interacts with his girlfriend and many of those who he has familiar ties with. This book is over a hundred pages long. And you get a roller coaster of emotion with him. It it more it mainly came from either confusion, surprise, just sympathy for the man, and just seeing how how his he feels off about the whole situation, like his whole. Mind, body, and spirit are like disarray. Like, he either been steamed by a mosquito that can give hallucinogenic in East Timor that give him conflict on what he been doing and why he been doing it and just trying to feel jealous or just feel envious of the people who lives normal life in America, who don't have to see a lot of this war-torn area, being able to live out peacefully, well, well, they're actually seeing the bitter truth. But, he actually did find his happy ending. It not in this book, it left in like a, a cliffhanger, in kind of way. But, if you read through, like, after that one last page, and see in the epilogue, he made it out alright. And during one of the interviews, I will link you to the description, yeah, he seemed to be better off by now. And not feeling the weight of all the things that he felt during this book. He actually feel like he's in a better place. So, this is the Speaking Dragon here, signing you out, and hope you all have a peaceful day.